What's going on guys? Andy here with Cut and Clean Lawn Care. What's going on guys? Andy here with Cutting Clean Lawn Care. I'm on your lawn, yep, you know we got it going on. It's hot outside, but we're grinding. And I'm not going to make this video too long and drawn out. Just between last night and today, I got kind of bored, and I like to come up with ideas on my own. I wanted to make a minor striping kit for the Gravely Pro Stance. Um, it's got a heavy footprint, it's a heavy machine, it's built like a tank, uh, so it leaves a little heavier wheel stripes than it does deck stripes. So I made myself a small, uh, like I said, a minimal striping kit. I'm a Gravely Pro Stance and I got myself a ghetto striping kit because my owner made it for me because he thinks it's gonna work and his name is cut and clean. Nothing real heavy, not laying the grass down really hard, but just to kind of compromise what the wheels do. So let's go through it real quick and I'll show you guys what I did. Um, I'm big into saving money and I'm big into fabricating and making things myself. Uh, I mean, why spend $300 on a striping kit when you can, you know, make one possibly yourself just out of stuff you have laying around in the house. So let's check it out, guys. So basically what I used for the striping kit itself is a heavy-duty rubber similar to what's on the Gravely for the uh, grass flap or grass shoot, whatever you want to call it. Um, and I just got that behind the deck, and it's mounted into the shields that are where the uh, pumps are, wheel motors. Uh, just one single bolt on each side, nothing too fancy. Uh, it seems like it'll hold up really good. And I got it set exactly one inch off the ground. So if I'm mowing it, you know, 3.75 to four, and uh, the flat behind it is down an inch, after the deck lays the grass down, the uh, little striping kit I made behind it's gonna lay the grass down again and hopefully give it a little deeper stripe. And from this angle, I'm laying on the ground, which is awesome. So I'm gonna give you a relative view of kind of where it's at, just to show you. Right behind the wheel right here, goes all the way through on both sides right here. And you might be able to see from the bolt, just bolted in right there on the back side on both sides of that shield. And like I said, it's one inch off the ground. So it'll give it that clearance for your obstacles, but at the same time, still lay the grass down a little more than the deck itself is going to. And I'll give you guys a better angle to actually see the flap itself from underneath the deck. So here we go, underneath the deck. And you can see it right there. Like I said, an inch off the ground. Still have clearance, and we'll just lay the grass down again. So just a real simple, simple, installation on the mower. I mean, there's nothing to it. And also a simple video. So thanks for watching. If you guys got ideas, tell me what you think about this. If you think there's other things I could have done, um, if you've done things similar, leave a comment in the video. Uh, show me your video if you put one up on your striping kits, because I'm always interested in this stuff. I like to see what people are doing. I like to see what people are coming up with. So uh, like, comment, subscribe, guys. Let me know what you think. Let me know if you think this is going to work. Um, probably not going to be mowing until Thursday or Friday again because of all the rain. But, guys, I appreciate it. Simple video. That's what I've been bored with today. Just made a striping kit for my mower. Like, comment, subscribe, guys, and we will see you in the next one.